Hi everyone, welcome back to The Chosen One by Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for your support. Today, word for tough times is, God said you should be using your gifts for me, not no one else. We got to be using our gift for God. You know, some of us, we are using our gift just to show off. And you wonder why God is getting on you. You have to use your gifts for God. And use it to, you know, bless others. But don't be conceited at all. You use it, even if it's dancing. When you're using your gift and you're dancing and the Holy Spirit tells you to go to that person and bring that person up to the altar, maybe they need deliverance in their body. You use it for God and allow God to, you know, point out whoever needs to be delivered. He will. In James 1 and 7, it says, Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above. Every gift that you have in you is come from God. So I want you to understand that whatever gift that you have in you, if it's dancing, if it's singing, if it's doing whatever you love to do, cooking, you let God do what he needs to do in you because God understands. And I want to say to you, you continue to pray. You continue to anoint your feet, anoint your hands, anoint your eyes, anoint whatever you, God is using in you. Anoint yourself. And say, Lord, use me for your glory. Lord, I ask, Father, that you strengthen me in the name of Jesus. If I, if you're a preacher, whatever your gift is, if it's a dancer, preacher, cooker, whatever your gift is, ask God to anoint you so you can be strong in it. Because you're going to go through some things. Trust me when I tell you, you're going to go through some things in your life. But you have to be strong and say, Lord, have your way in my life. Because the devil will try to get to you. He will try to get to you. When he know that you're good, he will try to get to you and tell you, oh, you need to stop. You need to stop all of this. You need to stop doing it because God don't care about you. Let me tell you this. We have to do what is best for us. And we have to understand that God is on our side. God is on your side. So whatever you uh, thinking or whatever you saying, Lord, I don't think I can do this no more. Use your gift. Pray over yourself. Anoint yourself and say, Lord, do whatever you need to do in me. And God will. Don't lose your faith. Don't lose yourself. Continue to pray. Continue to trust God and allow God to do whatever he needs to do in you. Because at the end of the day, God knows what you can do. Because sometimes we we listening to everybody else and stuff. Let me tell you, when somebody know that you're good in something, like, it could be your best friend. They will come to you and tell you, girl, you need to stop singing. You know what? You need to stop dancing. It ain't for you. I remember when I was so good in swimming, and when I was so good, you know, running and stuff, people would tell me, girl, you need to stop. It ain't for you. Anytime that you're hearing that, they basically telling you to quit. Don't give up your gift. I don't care how long you know them. I don't care what they're talking about. Don't let in. Do what you need to do for your soul. If God telling you to bless people by dancing, singing, by doing whatever you need to do, you do it. Long as it's positive, long as it's in the will of God, you will be fine. So let God use your gift and to bless others. Don't do it to show off but to bless. Let God use you. Use your body to bless others by anointing them and healing them. So use it for God's glory. So God bless you. Be encouraged. Keep your head up and be strong. I love you all. Stay blessed. Thank you for watching.